Gamma lizard is the name of a genus of small to moderate sized long tailed insectivorous old world lizards, and also is one of their common names. The genus Gamma includes at least 37 species in Africa, especially Sub Saharan Africa, where most regions are home to at least one species. Eurasian agamids are largely assigned to genus Laudacia. The various species differ in size, ranging from about 12 to 30 centimeters in length when fully grown. Their color also differs between species between genders, and according to mood, for example, a dominant male in display mode is far brighter than when it has been caught, beaten by another male, or otherwise alarmed. Females tend to be less colorful than the males of the species. According to species, agamas live in forests, in bush, among rocks and on crags, but where their habitat has been cleared, or simply invaded by humans, some species also adapt to life in villages and compounds. For example, inside the touch of huts and other sheltering crevices. Agamid's hind legs generally are long and powerful, and the lizards can run and leap swiftly when alarmed. Agamas are diurnal, that means they are active during the day. They can tolerate higher temperatures than most reptiles, but when temperatures approach 38 degrees Celsius, they generally shelter in the shade. Males frequently threaten each other by nodding, weaving and displaying their brightest colors to establish dominance. If that is insufficient, they lash their tails and threaten each other with open jaws. The jaws are very powerful and all the males commonly have damaged tails as souvenirs of past combat. Females may sometimes chase and fight one another and hatchlings mimic the adult's behavior. Agamas are mainly insectivorous, hunting prey by sight and snatching it opportunistically. Their incisor-like front teeth and powerful jaws are adapted to dealing with quite large, hard prey. They feed on omnivores, ants, grasshoppers, beetles and termites. They are sometimes prey to snakes. They sometimes also eat eggs of other lizards and sometimes feed on vegetable matter such as suitable grass, berries and seeds. Though not formally polygamous, dominant males commonly accommodate several females at a time in their territory. During courtship and also when asserting his territory, the male bobs his head in display. This gives rise to some of the common names such as Afrikaans Kogel Manatia, literally meaning the little mocking man. 
Females occasionally initiate courtship by offering their hind quarters to the male and provoking him to catch her. Typically, the breeding season is time for eggs to be laid during the season after the rains. Eggs are laid in clutches of up to 12, depending on species and the size of the female. Common species include the Agama aculeata, also known as the ground agama. And these are found in most parts of Africa. We also have the Agama africana, which is also called the West African rainbow lizard. Found in several countries also, including Liberia, Ivory Coast, Sierra Leone and Guinea. We have the Agama Agama, also known as the red-headed rock agama, or the common agama, or simply the rainbow agama. It is also found in several African countries. We also have the Agama Anchaita, also known as the western rock agama, the Anchaita's agama and is also found in several countries in Southern Africa. We also have the Agama Armata, also known as the Tropical Spiny Agama, found in several South African countries also. We have the Agama Atra, also known as the Southern Rock Agama, and also commonly found in Southern Africa. We also have the Agama Bogorti, the Bokorot Agama, which is commonly found in Senegal and Gambia. Then we have the Agama Boensis, which is usually called the Somali Agama. Yes, found in Somalia. We also have the Agama Botegi, which is usually found in Mali, Mauritania, Niger, and Senegal. We have the Agama Boeti, which is also known as the Mali Agama, and of course commonly found in Mali, Mauritania, Niger, and Senegal. We have the Agama Bolengeri, also known as the Bolengas Agama, mainly found in Mali and Mauritania. We have the Agama Cogdos Spinosa, also known as the Almenteita Rock Agama, which is found in Kenya. We have the Agama Cristata, also known as the Insula Agama and which is commonly found in Guinea Conakry and in Mali. The Agama Doria, however, is also called the Nigeria Agama and is found in several West African countries apart from Nigeria. We have the Agama Etoshai, also known as the Etosha Agama. This is uniquely found in Namibia. We also have the Agama Finchi, which is also known as the Finch Sagama or Malaba Rock Agama. It is commonly found in Western Kenya or Ethiopia. We have the Agama Gracii Membris, which is usually called the Bene Agama and is also found in the Republic of Benin Republic, Nigeria, Cameroon and other countries in West Af Africa. We also have the Agama Hatmani, 
or the Hartmann Zogama. We have the Agama Hispida, the common spiny Agama, which is found in the Republic of South Africa and other West South African countries. We have the Agama and Pelearis, also known as the Bronze Agama, which is commonly found in Morocco and some parts of Algeria. We have the Agama Insularis, also known as the Insula Agama, commonly found in the Ruma Island and in Guinea. We have the Agama Kai Mosai, commonly found in Kenya, Tanzania, and the Republic of Congo. We have the Agama Kerki, or the Kex Rock Agama, which is found in Malawi, Zambia, Zimbabwe, Mozambique. Botswana and southwestern Tanzania. We also have the Agama Lanzai, commonly found in Somalia. We have the Agama Lebretoni, which is also known as Lebreton Zagama, and which is found in several West African countries, including Nigeria. We have the Agama Lionotus also known as the Kenyan Rock Agama and is found in Tanzania, Uganda, Kenya and Ethiopia. We have the Agama Luceae which is found in Northern Ethiopia. We also have the Agama Montana also known as the Mountain Rock Agama commonly found in Tanzania. We also have the Agama Mozambica, also called the Mozambique Agama. This can be found in Tanzania, Malawi, Zambia, Mozambique, and Zimbabwe. We have the Agama Mucosoensis, also known as Mucoso Agama. This is found in Angola. We have the Agama Mwanzi. Mwanza flat headed rock agama, it is also called. And this can be found in Tanzania, Rwanda, and Kenya. On the list is also the Agama Parafricana, commonly found in Benin, Ghana, and Togo. Then there is Agama Paragama or the false Agama. This is found in northern Nigeria, northern Cameroon, Mali, and several other West African countries. There is the Agama Persimilis or the Somali painted Agama. Found in Somalia, Ethiopia, northeastern Kenya and East Kenya. The Agama Pitikauda is found in Carbon. Then we have the Agama Planiceps, which is also called the Namib Rock Agama, which is found commonly in Namibia. We have the Agama Rubechi, also called the Rubechi is Agama, mainly found in North Somalia and Eastern Ethiopia. Then we have the Agama Rupedi or the Rupedi Agama or the Aboril Agama. This is usually found in Somalia, Eastern Ethiopia, Kenya, and South Sudan. There is this Agama Sankaranika or the Senegal Agama found in Guinea, Nigeria, and other West African countries. The Agama Somalika is found in northeastern Somalia. The Agama Spinosa or the Lanza's spiny Agama is found in Egypt, Sudan, North Ethiopia, Eritrea, 
Djibouti and not Somalia. On the list is also the Agama Tassiliensis, commonly found in Mali, Niger, Algeria and Libya. The Agama Turensis is solely found in Tanzania. Then we have the Agama Waneri, commonly found in Benin Republic and some other West African countries. Then there is the Agama Wedozi, also known as the Gambia Agama. Of course, it can be found in Senegal, Gambia, West Mali, and Guinea Bissau. Yes, I'm a happy dude. I'm a happy, happy, happy dude. Happy, 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 happy. Happy, happy, happy dude. If you wanna be happy, say God bless. It'll make you happy.